Good morning, YouTube. I am... I finished doing my workout. Walking, that is. And now I'm going to the gym to work on legs today. Um, I didn't... There's an almost an end to the story with Hope biting the lady. She is doing well, by the way. Today is... Um, um, what do they call skin graft? There, she's going to be talking over the phone about some skin graft. That is just horrible. And um, I'm going to be there, of course. But what I found out about this lady is that she has no family here. She rents a room. Um, from this guy that has like two other guys in her and there. Uh, she pays almost $700 a month and her uh, check is a thousand. You can do the math. Well, she hardly had any food. I went and bought groceries. Um, I take her where she needs to go. I haven't done that yet because she always refuses, actually. And um, uh, I went out. We went out to breakfast. We had a really good time. She's basically lonely, and she does all the talking when we're talking. Well, I'm not doing any talking. She's doing all the talking. And um, what I also found out and witnessed. Uh, one of her roommates is very abusive. He looks like he's 35 or 40, and um, he said some rude thing. I gave him that look like, what the heck, are you, what did you just say? And then he said it again, and then my face went to, I will punch you in the face if you say that one more time. She has to get out of there. Um, and she's been doing this for two years and being abused for two years. Can you even imagine, like, your mother or your grandmother? She's 65. So, what I did is I called my, um, my landlord. The one who, where I park, I park at his, um his RV community and called and asked him did he have anything there I knew he did because he's such a hoarder and there were like I think there's like two or three that she can you know rent and so she can have her own place that's what I'm saying to myself have her own place and she has said it to me while we were at breakfast I just wish I had my own place well the good news is that he has something and the even better news is she's going to be by herself and she's going to have her own place and she's going to be even close by to me whatever she needs I can help her out uh, we have become like friend friends my mother told me to stop bugging her um, you know because in the beginning I was calling her like every day sometimes uh, twice <laughs> I know. it's just crazy but uh, now uh, she calls me. I'm so excited. And now we're texting each other. And uh, yesterday she uh, texts me and says, I cannot wait until I move into my own place. I haven't had my own place since I was married. Uh, so um, her name is Kathy. Can you believe that? Her name is Kathy. And she has one son. And I want to say he lives on the edge of Georgia, like right near Florida, I think. Um, I'm just so ecstatic. I cannot wait for her to move over here. You know, uh, she also said to me, um, she says, I wish I didn't get bite, get bit, but God has sent an angel to you so now you know I'm crying again right um 
but that's all I want to share I'm at the gym right now and I'm gonna go work it out and you guys have a great day talk to you later